Hello, I'm Essence Newhoff, the Folger Shakespeare Library's Director of Development. The Folger has a strong culture of philanthropy. My job here is to match the inspired generosity of donors with the passionate work of our staff. I'm intrigued with the story of Timon of Athens, a play that, in many ways, chronicles an individual who wants to be a philanthropist, but goes about it all wrong, and is so cheated by his friends that he ends up hating all of humanity. This Wyndham Lewis illustration for the play, drawn almost exactly 100 years ago, is riveting. Lewis, along with the poet Ezra Pound, was a leader of the briefly lived, but influential, London-based modernist movement known as Vorticism. The Guggenheim describes the Vorticist style as combining machine age forms and the focused energy suggested by a vortex. Here you see a character, presumably Timon, with his hands outstretched. Lewis doesn't note the act or scene he is illustrating, so the viewer can question, is this Timon being generous and giving? Or is he trying to wring the necks of those who betrayed him and in turn all humankind? Are his wrists together in a symbol of his feeling shackled by his situation? It's a highly visual representation of this play, and I love peering into the moment of history when Lewis created it.